all right guys welcome back to the channel and thanks for tuning in we are at drake on digital so guys we're going to talk about a massively undervalued cryptocurrency i'm really excited to talk to you about this because this literally reminds me of pokemon go guys like you guys remember how crazy that was people were like jumping off cliffs and uh killing no i'm just kidding they weren't killing each other but they were doing some crazy junk man i mean people were like going nuts over this but this is even better than pokemon go guys you gotta watch this video i'm so hyped about this project gotta check it out guys if you are not a part of the community yet go ahead and smash that subscribe button go ahead and smash that like button be in our community learn about all coin gems learn how to make some cash and learn how to make it out there in the crypto sphere so we're going to teach you guys about this over over what is this guys it's taken over the world no let's go ahead and get into it guys this sucker's not even being talked about it's crazy it's like number 1100 on um coin gecko but it, it's getting some track traction now and now is the time to come in guys in, in my opinion i mean i'm not a financial advisor uh this is just my opinion i'm just telling you what i'm doing you guys do what you guys do i'm gonna do what i do uh anyways guys you guys got big boy pants do what you need to do anyways let's get into it over what is it well guys it's like sand crypto it's like um decentral land let me show you guys these these are two similar projects we didn't feature decentral land on it because i thought eh, it's too big of a market cap so we featured sand we featured sand when it was at three cents if you don't believe me go check on my channel check it out it literally pumped like crazy uh <laughs> it's uh, it what is that um almost a 10x guys if you guys want to get into these gyms you got to be a part of the community learn about this junk but look, I'm seeing the same thing on this one. It's, it's just my opinion on what I see. Again, I'm not a financial advisor. And again, I can't make any decisions. I, I don't decide what it does. All I do is pray to God and uh, God takes care of the rest, guys. You got to give him all the glory, whether you win or lose. <laughs> but hey, just remember, guys, um, always pray to God. Always keep, keep a close connection with him. He'll bless those who follow him. Anyways, uh, get back into it. Sorry for the uh, side note, but here's Sand Cryptocurrency. Um, it's a $144 million market cap. Sand, if you don't know what it is, go ahead and check out our video. It's similar to like a Minecraft type of thing. Really cool. I'll show you guys the uh, website so you guys can get an understanding of it. Really just like the um, digital experience, similar to like a Minecraft would be. I don't want to see this. We'll exit that out just so you guys can see it. And Decentraland is similar, but we're gonna talk about Over. So Over is crazy. Let's go on their website and let's let it load. Guys, this is like augmented reality, high definition. Augmented reality is gonna be a huge thing in the future. If you guys have not seen Ready Player One, well, watch that movie because it is a game changer. Uh, so first off with this thing, they have a working app. The app is actually working. It's like Pokemon Go, it's so awesome. So you can relate this. This is something that's like a, um, you can display, in, you can like buy parcels of land in sections and areas. This is where it's different than Decentraland. So guys, this is pretty sweet. I'm gonna just play this demo so you guys can see it. Let's check out the system trouble. Oh man, look, painting on a wall. Anyways guys, uh, pretty interesting. You guys can play around with it, download the app yourself, uh, go treasure hunting. But anyways, this is a demo I found, so have fun. So here in Decentraland, you have like NFTs or little pieces of land that really don't exist. But with OVR, uh, it's crazy. So you can actually buy actual parcels of land in different locations. So say you're in New York or say you're in uh, Tampa or in Clearwater Beach and you want to own that little parcel. And that way when people are walking by, they can see your advertisements like looking on their phone, looking for like little treasure chests to get money and what, oh, hey, look, there's this restaurant. Hey, look, there's this ad. Mm, I'm hungry, I'm gonna go get this restaurant. Guys, companies are gonna buy little parcels of the land. There's only certain, uh, there's a limited supply. And in order to buy this land, what do you have to have? OVR token, that's how it works. Similar to sand. 
except it's um, a digital piece of land. But this is how it's different. It's real world land, but in virtual reality. So it's an augmented reality. So you're just like you, this is what augmented reality is. You watch a football game, you see those yellow lines going across the field. Yeah, those don't exist in real life. That's just on TV, guys. If you didn't know that, that is just on TV. So anyways, uh, it's really interesting. I'd recommend you guys check out the app. If you guys don't check out the app, that's fine. I'll go ahead and put a demo through my video. Um, it's like a one minute video. It'll show you walking through the Sistine Chapel. It's like an actual location. I, if you guys don't know what the Sistine Chapel is, well, visit it virtual and augmented reality. It's crazy. So they even have like um, augmented reality glasses to make the experience better and so on. It's really cool. So um, you can uh, get your own overland by buying it or you can go straight into the overland uh, place and buy it there or you can find it through treasure hunting. It's kind of cool. It's like Pokemon Go. You can find different treasure chests like one over token, two over token, 10 over token, 100 and 1000, etc. 1000 is pretty rare in my opinion, but because that's that's like finding 30 bucks right now. but. Uh, well, no, I'm sorry, 300 bucks right now, but in the future, who knows how much. That so here's a couple of the uh, different things that are featured on. You can click on each of these links like Yahoo, no Yahoo News, Yahoo Finance. Not su anything super special, but you can still click on them just to verify, just to take a look. Um, but it, it's it, this is Forbes India, so I, I mean, I don't know if it's anything special, but still, the technology is crazy. It's only a $2 million market cap. I mean, if you guys are worried about it, Wait till it goes to a 4 million, sell half, and ride the rest. See what happens. If it goes down, who cares? If it goes up, who cares? <laughs> um, but anyways, it's so cool. Uh, I, lo I love this project. I, I like video gaming stuff like this, but I, I used to be a big time gamer back then, and this thing really interests me. Um, exploring the world. OVR is a digital layer covering the entire globe. Uh, it has over 1.6 trillion uh, unique hexagons. So with those, like I was telling you, you have certain unique spaces of land. I'm gonna get my space over in Hawaii. That way no one else can buy it. I'm just kidding. That's, that's probably gonna be some expensive re, uh, real estate, but you can actually buy them. So you can go to the marketplace and I'll show you guys how. So it's really easy. In this case, you literally just link your MetaMask. I'm not gonna mess with it. Anyways, you link up your MetaMask, uh, take a look. You can literally click on any of these spots, zoom into it, see what type of land you're gonna get. Let's see what we got over here in Florida, man. Oh, uh, whoa, whoa, we gotta zoom out, boys. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's zoom out. I think we zoomed. Oh, nice. We're gonna go over here, man. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna buy a spot in Key West, boy. How much is one of these lands? Ah, <laughs> uh, no, I don't want any Adobe updates. Oh, dude, they're sold. Are you kidding me? All right, guys, these boys are gonna go fast. All right, so let's see where, where else we got land. So we can show you it looks like the price is only going to be a hundred of these tokens but obviously these tokens when they go up in price it's going to be more than just like 300 bucks or i'm sorry not 300 bucks 30 bucks Ooh, what is this oh yeah we can buy this parcel let's see what this is when you link your metamask uh, you can literally okay so look it's 73 uh, it's owned it's right now for 73 bucks ah oh, it's sold so maybe i can auction with him talk to him about it i don't know um, maybe I can find their wallet and try to say, hey, bro, let me buy your thing. Uh, but anyways, you guys get the concept. I guess we're going to go at, have to go over to like um, some place where no one wants to live. Um, no offense if you guys live in, what is this, Colorado? Yeah. Um, well, actually, Colorado, everyone wants to live there. Yeah, this, the Denver spaces are probably taken, I guarantee it. <laughs> oh, you know what? Oh, that's how. Uh, I'm so sorry. You guys just buy it right here. And we're going to enter into the auction and minimum bid and place bid. So that's it, super easy. You just have to have this land token. I can basically, if I wanted to, I can buy this whole thing besides these three spots. So you can literally buy any of these spots. So that's how it works. I, I, I'm sorry. So you guys can see all these spots. These are the ones that are already bought up. But anyways, so you guys can kind of get the concept. You guys can get these different digital lands. And when people are over there, you can customize each of the land. You can put build houses on it. Do whatever you want. It's crazy. You can put, you can display your NFTs. Be like, bro, come to my house. Visit me in virtual augmented reality. And they can visit with their phone. And then you'd be like, let me go check out your house, bro. And then you go to their house and all kinds of things. Look, look, uh, um, OVR live events. So basically, guys, this is going on so much. Just think about it. The gaming industry. None of these guys get out of the room. They just eat bags of chips and pasta and ramen noodles and just sit there like nom, 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 nom. Oh, yeah, I like Garfield and I like uh, playing this. Um, what is that stuff they play now? Uh, Modern Warfare or something? I don't know. Halo? 
I, I, I stopped playing games. I, I forgot about them, guys. I, I just don't have time for them anymore. But it, it's crazy. So, like, you can just be, like, hanging out with your friends, but digital. <laughs> I mean, what's better than that? If you're a fat man or a, a fat, yeah, a fat man in real life, you're going to be like a skinny man in augmented reality. It's fun. <laughs> Uh, so you have, um, it's basically like a real event. You can go to different auctions, go to different, uh, you can really go, it's everything you wanted to do, but digitally. So it's like, you can go do stuff and then, I mean, I, I guess you could do stuff and not even have the consequences of it, but I mean, still, I don't know. Uh, don't care about that part, but anyways, guys, this is crazy. It's interesting. So here's the treasure hunting. Let's let this page load because it's really cool. But anyways, you guys can go ahead and check out the treasures. Um, you literally just go into these, uh, well, in the app, you literally just walk around and you'd be like, oh, bro, yeah, this is so cool. So look, it, it sets up like this. Welcome to OVR treasure hunt. You like walk around. They got little boxes. You tap them. Oh, yeah, bro, we got a treasure chest. This is so cool. Yeah, whatever. We got some treasure. Oh, okay, that's awesome, Johnny. Um, and you guys can visit these people's lands. Like, guys, it's a, it's a neat concept, neat idea. It's only $2 million market cap. Are you kidding me? I mean, sand, they don't have anything like this. Sand and decentral land, they already took off like nuts and ham and they don't have an app like this. I mean, it's like Pokemon Go. Pokemon Go, they got like, what was it? Six, no, it wasn't six billion users. It was probably like 600 million users or something like that. It was crazy, like in the first year. So it, it's, crazy how quick this stuff grows but this is a quick overview i'm gonna play the app um I, I guess we can go ahead and go into the white paper so you can kind of see the market that they're hitting at right now because there's little spots and little spaces they want to hit so this is where they uh, um are believing most of the uh, marketers and most of the people are going to be wanting wanting to look for this but you can guys you can see the ad or the ar revenue the augmented reality revenue in 2024 it's looking to be 140 billion guys is only a two million dollar market cap what is that uh that is like a 0.0001 of the pie um hmm, there's a problem i see something wrong and that doesn't make sense anyways so let's get into it so here you can kind of pick your own avatar i assume you just take your own picture etc and you just kind of get into there. It's still uh, kind of, they're, they are building the app a little more. Um, it is live, so you can still play around with it, go get some treasure, get some of that early gold, man. Uh, play around with it. You can go into a restaurant, grocery store, or just wherever it finds. Um, and this is like a cash back. So basically you use the over token for the land acquisition. So um, when you're buying that land, you actually get cash back in it and you also get uh, staking in it. So it's a really interesting concept. Um, I do need to explain the uh, tokenomics. Tokenomics are a little interesting. Um, they are, it's very unique and it's good to prevent like rug pulls and overinflation, etc. cetera. Um, but here is their, uh, I guess you can say, overview of, I can't think of the word, I'm sorry. I'm drawing a blank, but basically their, their layout or their plan for the next year or two years, three years. So first they have the funding, Q1 or 2019, and you guys can see Q2, Q3, Q4. They're in 2020, they're doing pretty good, keeping up, uh, alpha, beta. Um, they're live uh, most for the most part. Right now they're going through the virtual land public sale um, and they are working on the app a little more and more. So that's always good, good for improvements. You guys can see all the upgrades and what they're doing. So it's not something that's like, oh yeah, this is a promise we're gonna make and this is how it's gonna work, no. So they're, they're featuring or trying to work on several different revenues, um, Google ads, Facebook ads, Instagram ads, all kinds. Guys will even be getting influencers involved, involvement of YouTubers of different countries, bringing the gaming world. So guys, look, I'm featuring this. I'm not a massive channel. They did not pay me anything for this. I just found this gym. Guys, this is gonna, just imagine if it gets on LEO Trades or on BitBoy Crypto or on Ivan on Tech. I mean, dude, this thing will go nuts. Just think about it. Um, I mean, it is so undervalued. You guys can see the uh, competitors that they have. OVR, Around, Arcona, and Infinity, or Infine, whatever it's called, uh, yeah. Iverse. <laughs> so you guys can see the comparison. This is a decentralized solution and it's crazy. So, uh, I mean, uh, you guys see it all the time. Well, you maybe don't, but uh, there's YouTubers who lose their YouTube channel. People lose their Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Dr Donald Trump gets banned off Twitter. It's ridiculous. I, I hate centralization. 
But anyways, let me go ahead and explain the tokenomics. This is really interesting. So they work off the IBCO. Um, this was, I believe, started by Bancor Network. Um, we featured Bancor Network on our channel as well. Really, really interesting. They do try to prevent impermanent loss, which is super important. If you guys don't know what impermanent loss is, it basically means if tokens go up, you lose your cash. <laughs> or to, if tokens go down, you randomly get more tokens than you assume, but who cares? Um, a piece of, having a piece of junk token, whether it's one or 10, it's still a piece of junk. Don't forget that, guys. Don't buy junk. Anyways, IVCO is scheduled by November 2020, so let's go ahead and explain how it works. So, if you guys can see this, great. If you can't, I'm so sorry, because I cannot zoom this in. Wait, I can. Command plus plus. Oh yeah, boys. Tech geek coming in the house. Watch out. All right, so here, look, we got buy tokens. So, as the tokens are being bought, the price goes up, but you have this little arrow right here that says token mint tokens minted. So basically as the price increases, there's going to be less tokens minted. But as the token uh, as the tokens are sold and the price goes down, there's going to be more tokens burned. So you see the tokens burned, there's going to be so there's going to be less and less. So it's it, it works both ways. So tokens minted, tokens burned. So when the price goes up, less tokens are made. When the price goes down, more tokens are burned so it's a um, fluctuating scale so to explain it in market cap wise this is how you can understand it so you have one token equal to one dollar great okay so now say the token reaches two dollars and that token is still or yeah there's still one token that means you have a market cap of two and you have one token but on the other end if you have a inflation rate of one token per year, that means it goes up to two dollars at the at the end of the year. Or I'm sorry, the market cap goes up two x, and you have one token equal to one dollar. And now the um, it, it went up two x. So now theoretically, you'd have two tokens at one dollar. That still um, uh, equals the two dollar market cap because you have one dollar token two tokens so that means two dollar market cap that's one times two now that's with a regular scale now say someone goes out and sell those tokens to someone else and it drops the price then it still is that two dollar market cap however with over they have the tokens stored so on one side they have the tokens on the market and then on the back end for liquidity, they have the DAI sitting there, or DAI is a stable coin. So they have the dollars sitting there to accept them when people sell it back. It's a complicated process, but just understand, the biggest thing to understand is this prevents like a, a rug pull and crazy price fluctuation. So it helps in, as in like if it goes way down in price, tokens are gonna be burned so the market cap still stays strong so it's it's really interesting when the market cap stays strong it basically means the price of the token is going to stay strong so it, it's a, hard to understand the concept but just play the video or play that last two minutes i just talked about a couple times and you'll understand it better anyway side note guys um minus the tech geek uh guys if you guys are enjoying this video if i brought any value to you guys go ahead and smash that like button smash that subscribe button Go ahead and hit that bell notification. That way you guys are notified every single time we make new videos and you guys are ahead of the game. Welcome to Drake Digital and be with the community. So this explains it as well. Exponential growth of price, linear growth of tokens, da 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 da. So that helps with the bonding curve. And also uh, another way to remember this is the faster or the higher the price goes up, the less tokens are gonna be minted. So very interesting concept. They also have a couple examples so you guys can look over it, but here's the tokens reserved for equity investors. 4,250,000 are reserved for equity. Um, and they have 15 days vesting period. It's basically released for 48 months. So pretty interesting, and you guys can see the vesting contracts here. Uh, you can actually go straight to Etherscan to check them out. And then you have the private sale investors. 
um, 30 or 3.1 million uh, OVR tokens to early investors of permitted uh, 26.5 million um, going to the team fund and then 5.95 million going to the advisors and the bounty program basically for issues that may happen community rewards i'm assuming that's like walking around finding stuff and yeah it says it right there foundation another 20 million and 320 million uh, or 320,000 reserved for liquidity bootstrapping etc so really interesting guys uh, you guys can see the token release curve um, basically if it were to release as they were assuming um, and this is the token release for the founders and advisors. There's a couple of the operating costs for the use of funds and we already talked about the different funds. So here you guys can see um, the breakdown of the funds as well uh, on a uh, basically a chart that looks a little nicer. <laughs> so you guys can kind of see it here. There's a couple of their team members. Um, you guys can look up each of those as well. I uh, looked up their LinkedIn's, Twitter's. Nothing super crazy or anything special, um, but still they built a great product and um, great idea, great concept. Uh, Got to give kudos to them. Um, so anyways, guys, a really interesting project, uh, very massively undervalued um, altcoin gem. It's called OVR. Not financial advice, just my opinion on the project. You guys got big boy pants. You guys do what you want to do. We're going to leave you guys with a wisdom one-liner. Proverbs chapter 28 verses, I think 28. Yeah, 28. When the, wicked rise, when the wicked rise to power, people go into hiding. But when the wicked perish, the righteous thrive. It's pretty interesting. I believe it. But guys, of course, I forgot to give this to you. So you guys can see the token release. So far, it's most mostly decentralized. You can see a lot of them are locked up in these smart contracts. You can see it is a big portion. But again, they're having to hold it for 48 months. So 48 months is four years. So there's a lot of time for these tokens to be released. And I think one of these, no, I'm sorry, two of these. So one's for liquidity mining, one's for staking and rewards, marketing. So really the team only has about 10 to 12% of it. So very good fair distribution in my opinion. But guys, you do you, uh, you guys do your own gig. I'm not gonna tell you guys exactly what to do. Um, but you guys can play around with it have fun. So guys Join Drake digital join our community and smash that like button smash the subscribe button. See you in the next one Thanks for watching guys If you guys are new to the channel go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button and hit that bell notification That way you guys can be ahead of the game every time we make a new video All right guys, thanks for watching and without you guys watching I wouldn't keep doing these videos, but I'm hoping I'm helping you guys if I am smash that like button um, go ahead and get started with the triple threat. Go ahead and start with the Celsius account. Here's a referral link where you guys can earn $20 in BTC. Really awesome. Set up a Celsius account, easy to use, and you get crazy interest rates on your Celsius account. Bitcoin, Litecoin, Ethereum, you name it. The next one in the triple threat is a crypto.com account. Super easy to use super easy to set up really easy to buy and sell on it i don't like how it doesn't have limit orders but really easy to use and here's another referral code for 25 bucks and cro um, here's the referral link a8gp you guys can read it but anyways guys a cool place to buy cryptocurrency on the go allows you to buy small altcoins um, unlike celsius celsius is more so like your bank account and the third one this one is a fun one uh, Voyager. This one is more so where you can buy with limit orders. It doesn't have as many altcoins as crypto.com, but it's really easy to use, easy to set up. And yes, this one does come with a referral link as well, and you'll get $25 in BTC. Um, this is how you can do a limit order. Super easy to use, and they don't charge any trading fees whatsoever. Here's the referral link. You can't copy and paste it, but you can look in the description to copy and paste, and you can put that in and set one up. 25 bucks, free BTC. This is the funnest one though, Lolly, free. There is a referral link to this one too. I've actually won 100,000 sats one time on one of the uh, taps, which is worth like 100 bucks in Bitcoin. So it's crazy. Um, look, and there's even proof in the wallet. Look at that, daily stack, 101. Guys, set one up, it's really easy to do. Download a Lolly account and just set it up.